Hey friends, so today it's been a while, but we got a grocery haul. So this is my Coles grocery shop. Budget is 200, we spent 194 using Nick's Flybys card. And then I done a separate transaction spending $8 using my Flybys card. So technically we did go over a few dollars, but that's okay. Um, we're also both starting different diets. I know you guys like how I talk, whoop. <laughs> I know you guys like how, oh, don't mind the background either, we're like, halfway started to clean and clearing out the fridge and all that anyway um i know you guys like to know the meal plans and things like that why i buy the items that i buy this looking at it as an overview i'm really happy there was only two pantry items and i know there's one thing i would have to go back i don't have to but i would like to go back and get some fresh ham midweek um i know i'm not going to need ham like for the next probably two three days so i didn't want to get it now um but yeah, I'll just do an overview of our groceries and then we'll do a rundown of like why I brought what and our meal plan. All right, so starting with fresh produce, carrots $1.50. I just got a singular red onion. Um, pretty much my dinners is going to be a chicken salad. So I got baby cost lettuce, I got baby spinach, I got the red onion, I'll have some carrot into it. We got some chicken there. And the chicken I'll bake with just probably salt, pepper, garlic powder to be honest, maybe some thyme from the garden. Our oh, cucumbers will be for the salad, and we already got some feta cheese I'll have for the salad. Um, this is what I'm happy about is two pantry items, one of them being apple cider vinegar. Also, when it comes to pantry items, I want to start getting organic where possible. This is only 50 cents more than the non-organic version, and it's something that like you use so little of. It lasts so long in the pantry, so I'm fine to spend an extra 50 cents for a better quality product. Um, otherwise, this isn't diet but this is something obviously I don't know just a yummy treat this is for me I did ring Nick and I'm like I am coming home with some Oreos Oreos and milk sounds so good right now did you want to pack it he said no um but I haven't tried this flavor yet so and it was half price so this is $1.25 the apple cider vinegar was $3.50 so I'll mix oh no we don't have mayonnaise okay I do need one more pantry product which was mayonnaise I forgot about that, but that's okay. I'll go back and get some mayo and I'll mix. My salad dressing is going to be like a mayo, apple cider vinegar base. And then, yeah, chicken, salad, dinners. That's my dinners for the week. One night just to break it up, we will do steak. So this was... I don't remember, to be honest. All right, so the packet, this is like the preset. It's not by weight. Um, they just say it's 450 grams. And this was... $14 for the pack of two. So yeah, to break up well, both of our meals, one night um, we'll have steak with the Brussels sprouts. These were $3.50 for the small bag of Brussels sprouts. So we'll share that. And then I'm personally going to have a baked sweet potato as well as an extra side and maybe even some peas. I don't know. We'll just see how we go. And Nick can do whatever he wants for his extra side. For Nick's lunches, he's going to have eggs and avocado. So I just got this um, one kilo bag of the unperfect avocados which they literally look perfect so these are like the non-perfect ones or whatever so there's five in there for six dollars a regular red onion oh yep yeah, so that's for my salad a mango each just because we love fruit the fruit to be honest didn't look very good well it was very empty and what was left didn't look the best so we only got a mango each for our fruit, but again, midweek, I might get some more fruit. Cucumbers for my salad. Broccolini is for Nick's dinner meal. He's doing like a keto chicken broccoli bake. The actual broccolis were teeny tiny and super expensive, so I opted for broccolini. They were $3.50 a bunch, so I got two. And that's pretty much the fresh produce. As well for a lunch, Nick likes salmon, so I just got him some smoked salmon chicken for me to bake for my salads and for him for his meals we also have a whole exactly like this a packet of chicken that i froze and took out so we have to use that first and then if we just don't have enough we can use that and whatever's left of here can get frozen nick has been mentioning for ages he wants to try duck again and he also wants to smoke something again so i saw this was 24 now down to 12 it is today's date um, but with this packaging and everything, like I'm sure it's fine, but obviously we'll open it up and check it. But he could, well, this is going to go in the freezer. He's not going to do it today because it's 41 degrees and we're busy with other things. Um, 
but he can hook this up in his smoker and smoke a whole duck and then have it for his meal and the leftover shredded up for his meat for like with his eggs and avo so then like we don't have to buy salmon or whatever um so yeah duck isn't a meat we generally eat because i wouldn't eat it i i don't touch it um he has tried it he does like it so that's just a really good price oreos like i said that was just my snack cheese i kind of put off the coles brand cheese to be honest and although that's much better value for money and normally it does taste good but the last one we got kind of put me off this one was on sale for nine dollars i've just realized now that it's 500 grams i don't know why i thought when i brought it i thought it was a kilo block but that's fine um, I'm pretty much not going to have much cheese anyway. I know Nick will eat cheese and he wants cheese to go with his casserole keto dish. This on Nick's flybys points was um, like a freebie so I got him this one. It's not keto friendly but I mean he's not doing keto like strict keto but he's doing more low to no carbs high fat diet whereas I'm the opposite. <laughs> it was free and we have couple of weeks to use it again for next dish he needed cream cheese so I, I couldn't figure out if he needed one or two I just got two blocks because they last a very long time it's fine to have just a block in the fridge even if he doesn't need it eggs we'll both be eating eggs throughout the week so I got two cartons of eggs these eggs was on sale for six dollars and 25 cents where the regular Coles brand that's a lower gram amount is normally like five dollars fifty so not even a dollar more it's a better quality egg it's free range and it's bigger eggs so yeah that's what i'm kind of now looking at when i buy eggs i don't really have a set egg farm that i buy them from but i just want the more bigger ones hopefully free range and see just what's on sale we got milk three dollars three dollars fifty i believe for two liters or maybe it's two ninety. I can't remember the price of the milk. But we got some milk. Um, although, although with keto diets you don't have milk. He's not doing strict keto. So he will still have a regular milk. Fussy Cat Food for Luna. This one was actually 40% off. And I was tempted to get a couple. Because she goes crazy for this food. Like she has gained. I, I wouldn't say a lot. But she's definitely been gaining weight. Since from the diet food from the vets to now this. She just eats. She just goes crazy for this. She eats so much of it. Um, also here with cheese, Nick just enjoys cheese and it's been a while since I brought him fancy cheese. This one was also 40% off so it ended up being $5. Just this fancy looking smoked cheese. Again, not something I would eat or touch but he can have a piece as a treat. Cat food wasn't on sale so I just got what she needed for the week. To be honest, she probably didn't even need this. I didn't really do a count of the cat food. I knew she needed some but she just has half a pouch a night she doesn't eat the whole one so that's six nights i know we had some so that's still plenty for the week these are a dollar fifty each neurofin um we ran out so just to get some of that six dollars fifty these were half price the rexona deodorants these are men roll on deodorants we both share i use men deodorant it just works better they're the female deodorant a lot of people think that's weird but it just honestly does work better. So for this range of the Rexona was half price, making these $1.75 each. I just got one of each. Um, yeah. <clears throat> I'll talk about the Listerine in just a minute. Back up here, Diet Right Cordial. No added sugar. It's just a cordial we like to add in with our water. This is $3.50. We've been loving. Nick's been drinking rum and I've been having a flavoured vodka with some lemonade after work. Each night we'll have one or two drinks. Or no drinks. We don't drink every night either um so we do stock up down on lemonades generally about three to four bottles last us we still have like a bottle left over from last week but it was some sale for a dollar 80 so i just got that and then sometimes i do enjoy coke or pepsi i'm not fussed with the difference i just get what is on sale again a dollar 80 for the pepsi so i got that and cat litter this is the cat litter that we get six dollars fifty there is a present. There is two more items that's included. So this is pretty much everything here. But including with my total, there is two more items that I didn't mention. But those two items is for a gift. So I don't want to show them because I know she watches my videos. And this is going to go up same day. So I've shot this. I'm filming this. I'm going to edit and upload this all on the same day. And I'm not going to gift the gift until tomorrow night, actually. So just in case she does end up watching, I'm not sure when that, but there is two gifts in with that total price. It's probably 
um, say knock off $15 of that total price and then that's how much the groceries cost. Now with the Listerine, so Nick has his own flyby card now, whoop, there we go, so now with the Listerine, Nick has his own flybys card now, I just do the shopping still um, and I use it, but my spends was getting too high and a lot of people on the page say the females have managed to get the husbands to get the cards, like their own cards to sign up. And it definitely works. I've never had so many flyby points before using both different accounts because when mine was too high, I stopped using my flyby card, so I was using Nick's. His was a new account, everything was cheap, all his spends was cheap. And then because I was stopped using my card, my prices on flybys have now gone down. Um, so I just completed a full week spend at Carl's using flybys. I decided just to set you guys up there, <laughs> just kind of, just kind of rough. So my spend has gone down, but one thing I had on my flybys was 500 gram or meal, what is it? 500 meal bottle of Listerine in any 500 meal range, I'll get 400 points back. Um, oh, so, so yeah, for the majority of the shop, we did use Nick's card just because I've just on a four week spend. So then to make mine not so high because Nick's card hasn't been used for four weeks. Yeah, but I did do this separate, separate transaction. I get 800 points back and these are normally $8. They're currently half price for $4. 800 points converted to dollars is $4. So essentially I've got these items for free. I just had to pay for cash outright and in a couple of days I will get that money back as points on my flybys. Um, that's what I was saying to Nick as well, like with this and like with the deodorant, I wish we were in the situation to have a little bit more extra money so I can stock up when there's a really good deal. Even with the cat food, to be honest, I haven't seen this at 40%. I think the biggest sale I've seen is 30%. It would have been nice to stock up knowing how much he loves this and it is kind of expensive. Um, well, I mean, as the price is cheap, but the bag size is small. So if you're working at five a kilo, it works out kind of expensive. Anyway, so yeah, <laughs> I had a separate transaction just for these. To be, there was another one, but scanned up as eight dollars, and I was like, oh, it's not half price. And she goes, well, no, it's eight dollars, but she didn't check or anything, so I just said I didn't want it. Um, otherwise, yeah, we just got two, so it's not much, but it still ends up being free product or getting our money back, which is really fun to me. Um, so yeah, all this is gonna feed us. It doesn't look like much food, but it is breads. Oh, I should say that as well. My lunches are gonna be sourdough. On toast whether it'll be like eggs on toast or if I just make I don't know Vegemite on toast or that's what I thought I would do ham and cheese toasties that's why I wanted ham but I'm not making dough yet so and if we don't have any I'll do that in a couple of days that will be my lunch and then my dinner's chicken salad Nick's lunch is his avocado egg salmon and his dinner is that creamy chicken broccoli bake and we generally don't eat breakfast and any snacks I don't know, I guess we're just going to have to make it from scratch if we want anything that's diet friendly. Because we got like all baking things and I got all the no sugar sugar or the non sugar sugar, like the sweeteners and still the sugar free chocolates and things like that. So we can get creative from what's in our pantry to help us with snacks or whatever. But yeah, otherwise that is all for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. Please give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.